Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kerry, I'm a mum of two and I'm a lover of all things beauty, makeup, skin, skincare, hair care, all that kind of good stuff. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by and I hope that you stay. Please don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell and also thumbs up this video if you do like this kind of thing. And if you're not new here, thank you for coming back. It really does mean a lot to me. Um, just quick thing, um, if you're not new here, you'll already know this. If you are new, then i've got a five month old baby she's learned to roll onto her tummy which is really really exciting um she can roll onto her tummy but she can't roll back so she's in the room at the minute she's playing with the toys um she is on the floor so if you hear any baby noises whinging crying anything like that it just means that she's rolled onto her belly and she's stuck so i'll have to go and save it you're not going crazy there is a baby in the house Anyway, guys, without me babbling, again, please don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up and ring the bell. And I'm going to get into this video. So I'm so, so excited because we've got the P. It's literally just arrived about 10 minutes ago. We've got the P. Louise uh, budget box. Um, so this is £30 a month. Um, I personally just buy it monthly i do i go onto the website monthly and just buy it there, she has set up a subscription service now where you can subscribe for either monthly three monthly six monthly or yearly i think it is i think if you do the yearly one it works out that you get a box free because of the saving in the cost um so it's 30 pound a month and every month you're charged a pound shipping um so yeah so um she normally puts an unreleased item in here um i don't know if she does that every single month because this is quite new to me i've only done this maybe three or four times um but yeah she generally puts um an unreleased item in i have seen a few pictures a few stories on her facebook and her instagram about the new liners so i'm hoping there's one of these in here um but just before i do open this i did actually get excited and thought that she'd sent me a freebie um until i checked my order and realized that i actually ordered this so if you order the budget box say at the beginning of the month and you order something else at the same time anything an eyeshadow palette a lipstick a lip liner whatever you order it will get shipped out with the budget box at the end of the month so just bear that in mind um if you want something and you kind of want it now um then i would order that separately um so when i ordered my budget box i also ordered this um brush kit so it's the mirror mirror brush kit so it's got a mirror on the front of it first of all but yeah i did i got excited thinking that i'd got a freebie but then when i checked my order i hadn't um and then inside we've just got three blending uh, sorry three sort of well i'm assuming these are for a bases so we've got three brushes so we have got i'm really sorry i don't have my glasses on and i forgot to put my contact lenses in um i have got my glasses here if i do need them but i've got like massive lashes on today if you can see so i want to avoid putting them on but we've got the 7071 the 7064 and the 7032 brushes so they just look like that focuses and they are for the bases um or concealer if you wanted to use them for concealer or any cream product really um but yeah so i just i did get that brush set um and as promised when i did my p louise haul um i did mention that i had bought the queen the conqueror palette i think that's what it's called um but it was damaged so they did send me a replacement they sent it in this box which was their base's birthday i've had this sat here a while honestly um but i did say that when the budget box came in i would show it um just in case you haven't seen it which i'm sure that you have um but obviously she packages all the products really really well um it was just unfortunate that the last one when it got to me the mirror was broken um so the outer carton just looks like this i'm not going to go too much into this one um but yeah the outer carton just looks like this and then when you open it up it kind of opens up into a chess board so if you like chess i guess you could play chess and then the other side just looks like this and it's a double-sided palette so we've got loads of really nice pinks in that side and a nice big mirror, excuse the mess in the house. And then on this side, we've got kind of more yellowy, greeny tones. Oh, there we go. So yeah, I do, I really just love the P. Louise formula. I think it's amazing. I'm actually wearing um, one of the Wedding Wish palettes today. Um, it's the, which one is it? one of the wedding wish i meant one of the love tapes um and it's the wedding wish palette um so i'll just quickly i know i'm not very good at that i do apologize um but i just went in with this shade first which is ring on it then i deepened up the outer corner with this one which is hashtag wifey 
and then I cut the crease and I went in with this shade here which is called Commitments. So they're the only three shades that I've got on my eye today. Um, but yeah, really, really love her formula. I think it's amazing. Anyway, let's get into the good stuff now. Not that that's not good stuff because it really is. But yeah, so I don't know what's in this box. I haven't seen any unboxing. So we'll just open it. And all the packaging as well, guys, is just like, look, look how cute. How cute is this? So it says budget box on it and it says the most reliable way to predict your future is to create it. And then obviously we've got all the little Easter eggs and stuff on there. Like it's just so, so cute. And I do love her packaging. And her boxes are so sturdy as well. I went to throw some in the bin the other day um, and I stood on them and honestly, like it took me ages to squish them. So yeah, so every month we just get a card and it just says budget box by P. Louise for babes on a budget. Welcome to the world of P. Louise. We do things differently here. And it just says the same thing on both sides. Um, and I think she changes that kind of every month because that's got blue on it. I've never seen blue on it before. So that's just my shipping note. Ooh, I can see things. Okay, so first of all, we've got this texture treatment and this is P. Louise skin. What is this? I don't really know what this is. I don't know if it's some sort of a moisturizer or... Oh, it's really like runny. I don't, I think, do I own anything from P. Louise Skin? I don't know if I do. Um, so the packaging just looks like this and it is full size. Really, really pretty actually. And then it's almost like, let me see if I can kind of show you the color of it. It's like a really almost like a custard color i don't want to tip it too far because it is really really liquidy but i'm not too sure what this actually is i will have to have a look on a website but yeah so this is the texture skin it actually feels like a moisturizer i'll have to look that up and Actually, it does smell really good though, but I will have to look that up and see what that actually is. But yeah, so we've got a texture treatment. Again, not too sure what it is, but happy to receive that. And it's nice that she does put skincare in here as well. So you're not just only getting makeup, even though I think predominantly that's what everybody buys it for. Um, we've then got something else from P. Louise Skin. So this is the Gentle Gorgeous Glow Getting um and this is gently massage a small amount of your p louise skin texture treatment onto the face and neck oh so this must go with this then um so texture treatment muslin cleansing cloth right okay so gently massage a small amount of your p louise skin texture treatment onto the face and neck and begin the removal of your makeup and grime from the long day beforehand submerge your p louise skin muslin cloth into steamy hot water afterwards lightly squeeze out any excess water and place cloth over the face and neck for a few seconds the heat and steam will slowly begin to open your pores to drain any toxins and filth leaving your skin replenished and refreshed then fold the hot cloth into a square and work the cloth across the face and neck to remove all traces of the cleanser and makeup do so in small circular movements proceed to rinse the cloth in cool water and again hold over the face and neck this will close the pores leaving the skin silky soft and soothed um, so hand wash the cloth in warm water, rinse, vigor rinse rigorously, then hang dry. As another option, treat as white cotton in the washing machine. So, and this is a pack of three cloths. So it just looks like that. So the texture treatment is, I'm assuming some sort of like a makeup balm, like a cleansing balm. And then inside, get a little packet and then the cloth. Just look, I'm only going to pull one out, obviously, like this. Oh, so they're quite big and they've got the PL logo on, which I really like if it focuses. Because I hate when you get stuff like this and it's like unbranded because I just feel like you've probably just bought it off AliExpress or something. Um, but yeah, so they are quite large, will definitely cover my face and neck. Um, so yeah, really, really excited to try that, actually. Um, I didn't even know that she did cleansers but yeah really really excited to try that one um so i'm guessing i'm going to assume then so that's kind of 
like this will come together maybe i don't know have to have a look on our website um but yeah and then we have got <clears throat> uh protect your pout um, for attractive lips speak words of kindness and this is the cocoa loving uh, this is something else from p louise skin i think is this one of the lip balms uh, protects and hydrates dry and damaged lips with each application um so that just looks like that and it comes on a little key ring it's gonna focus there we go <clears throat> and then the outer carton just looks like this i believe that this is actually one of her newer ones um so let's have a sniff oh god that smells so good i don't really eat chocolate um but i do love the smell of it and I don't know why I'm testing it because you can't see anything and I know that I like these because I received one in the Christmas budget box um but yeah so that's really really nice and it's good because like I said it's a new product um it's not unreleased now because she has released them but yeah so really 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 excited to try that um we then got a mini brush so it's just a flat brush it doesn't have a number or anything on it it just says P Louise and again it looks like it's for her bases um cause, or maybe even a skincare um but i know that she does do um like blush bases and bronzer bases so if it's too big for your eye i mean you could use this for your foundation or your concealer or anything like that anything you want so um but it feels really good no bristles coming out anything like that really really like that and i do really like p louise brushes as well and then the last thing so i think this is what everyone is excited for so we've got the easter egg so it just looks like that i got the purple one so it just says also oh, extra sometimes it's okay not to put uh, sometimes it's okay to put all your eggs in one basket believe in yourself and um, so we get a hop oh so so babe you've purchased your p louise easter egg and gave into the temptations inside now it's time to take part in our p louise egg hunt so hop on over to the website find the hidden egg within one of our web pages Click on the egg for your exclusive surprise. Happy hunting, babe. Together, let's get excited expectations and create something magical. Um, just one second, the baby is on a belly. So yeah, guys, so I think this is the one that everyone was excited for. Um, ooh, feels like it's Easter. Um, so the outer carton just looks like that, really, really cute. I know a lot of people do collect the P. Louise packaging. I personally don't just because it, I've ordered a lot of stuff. <laughs> um, so yeah, so inside the egg itself just looks like this. I think I will keep this just because it is really, really cute. Um, and to be honest, I might even fill it with little chocolate eggs at Eastern. Give it to my daughter. The 13 year old, not the five, five month old. <laughs> um, oh, I can't get into it. Oh, there we go. Oh, right, okay. So it's filled with products. So we've got three products inside. Um, so first thing that we've got is we've got the Stay Shining Super Hydrating Formula. But what are you? Leave a little shine wherever you go. Oh, so this is a lip oil um, and it's in the shade Indulge Me. So the outer carton just looks like this. Really cute. And then inside, oh my gosh, look, look at that. In that cute that is so so cute um so we've got the lip oil and it is oh oh my gosh it's chocolate again you're not gonna see anything but the door foot just looks like that nice and big it's really really like that and it fit i think this is it's glass packaging as well you know It just smells so good. It smells so good. Honestly, it does. Then we have got... Oh, so I think these are one of the new liners. So this is the in the shade Piggy Bank. And it's double the precision, double the impact. Um, on one, oh, right. Okay. So I've got the shade Orchid in Me and Piggy Bank. Um, so the outer carton just looks like this. So really, really cute. And then inside the product... So yeah, I'm really excited to try these. I would, I was gonna order them, but I thought I'll wait and see if it's in my box and if it is, I'll see which one I get. 
So we've got a purple on one end and a pink on the other end. And I think these are just literally liners. Oh, oh no, be careful. Be careful guys, it's runny. Right, one sec, let me just sort my, look. Oh, one. okay, so let's try that again. But yeah, it is, it's really liquidy. Maybe I should shake it first. Does it tell me to shake it? Maybe that's my fault for not reading. So it doesn't say anything about shaking it. But yeah, maybe just give them a shake before before you open them. But it could just be that because they've been sort of compressed in and then they've been in transit, that maybe they've just gone a bit explosive. Oh my gosh, guys. So look. So like really, really pigmented. I really love that pastel purple. That's really, really nice. Yeah, I just don't like that it's leaking all over, but that's fine. Um, and then we've got this pink shade, which, so the pink one is called Piggy Bank. And then that one just looks like, oh my God, so, so nice. So yeah, so I didn't have any problems when I shook it. So shake it first. But yeah, so they're the two colors there. So we've got, so we've got Orchid in me at the top and then we've got Piggy Bank at the bottom. Really, really pretty. And then the very last thing that we've got in here is this. So this is the wet set, set wet set, wet set. And this is the liquid eyeshadow. Um, and this is in the spray, the shade Spring Sister. So I do like that she's given a variety of colours because I did think that because I know that she's got like she's she's got these in pink and purple, she's got these in green. Um I think she's got six or eight of each colour, I can't quite remember. Um, but I do like that she's given a variety of products, so you've not just got all purple or all green. Um, so yeah, so the outer carton just looks like this. Really, really cute. And then inside the product itself looks like this. Again, I feel like is it frosted? I feel like it's frosted glass, you know. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is stunning. And the door foot is huge as well, so. And then like, look, just look how pigmented that is. Oh my gosh. And it feels totally different to her bases as well. Because I did think that. I thought, well, she does bases, so what's the difference? But that is just such a nice... It's just a unique colour as well. Like, I don't think I've seen a colour or many colours that shade to be honest with you um but yeah anyway guys what did you think of this month's box i thought i think for 30 pound it's well worth it i got a cleanser some cloths a lip oil a lip balm a liner an eyeshadow a brush um then also we got the keepsake egg so yeah i really really enjoyed this month's box i thought i mean to be honest i've enjoyed all of the boxes and i've already ordered the april box um just one thing to note though um if you do order it if you're new to p louise so i know at the moment the april box is live on her website but if you order it now it won't be shipped out until the last day of april i believe um so you won't receive it until may if that makes any sense um so this is the march box but obviously i'm uploading it in april um but yeah guys anyway what did you guys think did you get the box this month what did you get did you get the same as me did you get different shades um what do you think of it do you think it's definitely value for money and leave a comment down below as well um if you have any other suggestions for unboxing videos the only thing i will say is i'm not really a fan of glossy box because I buy all the products myself, I do have to think about, is it a product I'm going to use? And honestly, I just feel like glossy boxes, the samples are too small. You don't really get enough use out of them to know whether or not you're going to like them. And I feel like you get a lot of repeats in there. So I've kind of gone off glossy box a little bit. But any other subscription boxes that you want me to unbox, just leave me a comment down below and let me know. Anyway, guys, that's everything from me today. Um, so, yeah, I hope that you have enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>